Here's Mincy. If you want to say hi, <laughs> she's crazy right now. Okay, so I just finished making my salad. Look how good it looks. today's video I am making a little what I eat in a day vlog so I hope you guys will enjoy it I already ate breakfast which you probably saw at a little local diner that me and Ben walked to right now it's I think like 11 o'clock so I'm gonna go do some work and then I usually eat lunch closer to like 2 o'clock um, so I guess I will catch back up with you guys whenever it's lunchtime but other than that um, oh here's Mincy if you want to say hi <laughs> she's crazy right now um, but yeah, other than that, I guess I'll check back in with you and then we'll go from there for my little daily what I eat in a day. <laughs> Okay, so I just finished my project for work and I'm thinking right now it's so nice out that I want to go out in the backyard and probably rake some leaves and pick up some sticks, which does not sound very fun, but it needs to be done and I've been putting it off for like a week or two now. So I'm going to go do that and then maybe get a coffee from Starbucks. It's like 1230 right now, so I worked for like an hour, but like... I'm a little hungry, but I don't know if I'm hungry enough yet for lunch. So I'm thinking go do the yard work and then get a coffee and then closer to two, I'll actually eat that I think. Yeah, so I guess I will catch back up with you guys um, after I get my coffee. <laughs> I just got my coffee from Starbucks. I am parked, don't worry, I'm not driving right now. Um, and my new favorite order I just had to share with you guys that I've been getting is a decaf grande shaken espresso with the vanilla sweet cold foam on top. And it is just divine. It's a little sweet, but like not too sweet, you know? So it's like perfect for a little midday pick me up, even though it doesn't have caffeine in it, the sugar does its work. Also, I got honked at by someone and it was really sad and made me really embarrassed. So my days look slightly ruined, but not fully, you know? Maybe I'm just a baby about that kind of stuff, but I get like very uncomfortable when people like yell at me or like honk at me while I'm driving. But anyway, I'm gonna go inside and make some lunch now. And I think my package might be here. So um, yeah, I'm gonna go and I will catch back up with you guys. All right, it is finally lunchtime. It is about 2.17 right now. So I am very hungry. <laughs> um, but yeah, for lunch, I'm gonna be making this salad that um, is kind of inspired by the Kim K or like Kardashian salad I keep seeing on Instagram. It has basically like I think five or six total ingredients. So salami, which I just got from Whole Foods, grape tomatoes in it. I definitely kind of like improvised and made it my own to be fair. I had an avocado, like half of one is good. Some mixed greens, 
and then um, I do chickpeas in mine, which is really good, and then some Parmesan as well. And finally, just the dressing, which I made last night. I have a little bit left of it. It looks really gross, but I promise it tastes good. But basically, it, um, what's in it is olive oil, balsamic, vinegar, some Dijon mustard, and then minced garlic. And then I put a little salt and pepper and just whisked it together. So, you know, it's pretty simple, but it's super good, like, all together. I'm very excited to eat this. I already have the avocado and tomatoes cut up so now I'm just gonna keep going cut everything else up and toss it together and finally eat something so I do not pass out <laughs> So I just finished making my salad. Look how good it looks. I'm, a, I'm so excited to eat this, but um, yeah, it was super easy to make. This is like probably one of my new favorite recipes for salads. My only other favorite salad would have to be like, I don't even know the proper name for it, but it's like arugula with like um, mixed tomatoes and um, mozzarella. So that's like my favorite kind of salad, but this is coming in a close second, so. Anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna go enjoy this and then I probably have to go up and do a little bit more work. And then once I'm done with that, I'm hoping to take Tito for a walk maybe or go back outside because it's like in the low 70s today. So it's like perfect fall weather. So yeah, that's kind of my plan, but I'm gonna eat this and go from there. It is six o'clock now and it is time for me to start dinner because Survivor is on at eight o'clock tonight and I need to have dinner done before then so I can eat, shower, and be ready to watch my show. So um, basically what I'm gonna be making tonight is a pasta dish with like peppers, onion, and Italian sausage in it and I make my own like cream sauce with it. So um, yeah, it's pretty good in my opinion. Um, you could probably be the judge of it if you try it at home, but I'm gonna go ahead and get all the ingredients out and show you guys how I make this little pepper uh, pasta dish.
little bit later now, almost nine o'clock. Um, I just wanted to check back in because I just showered. But basically, I am a big idiot because the show I was telling you guys I was gonna go watch, Survivor, is actually not on tonight. It's on tomorrow night at eight o'clock. So that is slightly disappointing, but it's okay. I'm gonna go watch a movie instead um, or maybe watch some more Modern Family if not. But um, yeah, anyway, it's been a pretty great day. I feel like I ate overall pretty healthy and pretty good to be honest. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what I typically eat and enjoyed the recipe I showed you for the pasta. Um, but yeah, if you guys liked it, make sure to give the video a thumbs up and subscribe. And thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate all of you and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.